Noteful can link items in your notes, text boxes, photos, shapes, and even your handwritten notes. With text boxes, it is very easy to get started. You can link either a web page or notebook. Let's choose notebook for this first time. After choosing the notebook you want, you can then choose the page you want to link to. A simple long press takes you to the hyperlink. For shapes, the process is the same. I like that when you're going through your notebooks, the app indicates when you last worked on different notebooks. It's much easier to find a notebook because right now, I want to find a notebook I was working on a few minutes ago. When you select text inside a text box, you start working on the text and the linking option will no longer be available. So you should remember, with your text boxes, the link attaches to the whole text box, not a few individual words. Images can also link to any page in the app. But this time, let's link to this notebook to create a hyperlink. That's the default option you have when you choose to link to a notebook. Look at that. Linking to handwriting takes several steps. You must group the handwriting first using the lasso tool. It is that group that you then link to. To edit a link, simply go to the link, as if you're creating it for the first time. Once you've changed it, you've effectively edited it. Web links are also better packaged now, and going to them is super easy. Hope this will help you get more organized as you link different items across your notebooks and pages. Noteful even lets you copy links that you can paste in other apps. Now let's close the app and go paste this link in Apple Notes. And it takes you right to the exact page in Noteful. This might give me a very good reason to return to the app, if only it could handle text like Apple Notes. Tis a shame.